Alright. Hi! <laughs> My name is Kinsley Carter, aka KK, and I'm here with another YouTube video. So if you in a are uh, if you are an adult entertainer, and by adult entertainer, I meet everybody from the adult film stars to the strippers to the massage parlor girls. Yes, I know we be forgetting about y'all, but I haven't. So this is for y'all too. And you know, you are looking for an extra source of income. This video is definitely for you. Now, this list is in no particular order at all. Also, um, I don't want you to look at this list and think you can make a living off of it or anything. Uh, of course, like if you're consistent and you have a fan base um, that's constantly asking you 40 things, by all means, make your money, honey. So, let's get into this list. <laughs> First thing on my list is Skype calls or FaceTime calls. So, it's basically a video call between you and a fan. One thing that I highly recommend is for you to have a list of do's and don'ts and what is to be expected when you have a video call with your fan um, so there is no miscommunication or misunderstanding when y'all have your call. It's all about having fun and a great time. Me personally, I use the platform Minivid to set up my calls. And as far as payment, which I know is probably another question, how much should I charge? Uh, the way I go about it is I look for girls that are adult film stars and that have a similar look and also similar following as me. Also, you can charge whatever you want to charge. I mean, trust me, it will be a clientele out there that will pay what you are charging. So don't even worry about it. <laughs> Next, you can sell merchandise, whether it's a shirt, a mug, um, poster, whatever the case may be. You can sell these to your fans um, on an online store. Also, if you do feature dances, you can sell them there um, at conventions or if you do store signings. Uh, these are perfect places where you can sell your merchandise to your fans. I mean, they're there to see you. And I'm telling you, they want to walk away with something to remind them of that memory. Third on my list is webcamming. This is really good when you need extra money, of course. The only tricky thing when it comes to webcamming is being consistent or at least having a schedule to where your fans can expect to see you on. Uh, that's where I mess up at is having a schedule because my, my life is just so unpredictable. But if you have a set schedule, I highly, highly advise you to go through a webcamming. Um, there are tons of websites that you can use when it comes to webcamming. Live Jasmine is really good. Chatterbait is really good. Um, My Free Cams is good. I mean, the, the list goes on. Um, also, all these websites, they have their different rules, uh, what they require from their models so definitely give it a try with every different webcam site and stick to the one that you enjoy the most next is phone sex operator um if you have that sexy voice that just gives everyone chills or even if you don't still try it out um i believe i don't mark me on this but I believe for some websites, they give you training on how to talk uh, over the phone to fans. So, yeah, definitely give it a try. Look into it. You get paid by the minute by how long you are on the phone with the fan. And, it, yeah, make some extra money. And the next side hustle, which is very similar to a phone sex operator, is a sexting operator. Uh, which is basically sending some sexy text messages back and forth with a fan. Uh, and I believe the payment is by each text that is sent back and forth. Uh, again, it can vary by whatever website you choose to use. Speaking of websites, a very popular website that is used amongst adult, adult film stars is Sex Panther. Um, I'm pretty sure everyone can use it, so definitely give it a try if you're looking for some side money. All right, next, create content. We have platforms that make it easier for us to sell our at home videos uh, 
to our fan base. So some platforms that you can use is Snapchat, Minivids, I Want Clips, Clips for Sale, um, OnlyFans. I can go on and on, but those are the five popular that I am familiar with that you can sell your content on. So to give you a few examples of types of videos that you can do, um, you can film yourself in the shower, uh, if you're good at stripping, you can even film yourself stretching, um, whatever it is, trust me, someone is out there that will pay to watch your video. So just play around with it, see what sells, see what the fans are attracting to and make your money, honey. <laughs> Next, you can sell your regular clothes. Um, anything that you can't fit into or, you know, shoes you've grown out of, uh, sell it on websites like Poshmark or eBay. I'm pretty sure there's other websites as well, but those are the two that I'm familiar with. And, yeah, make your money back. Next, uh, something that's very, very popular is selling feet pics uh foot fetish is very real people so if you have like a fresh pedicure or something um just just take a whole bunch of photos of it uh and i'm not really sure what platforms you can sell feet photos on um i mean you can make it as a store item if you have mini vids i'm pretty sure there's a bunch of platforms um i heard fet life you can sell feet pics on as well um i don't really i don't really sell feet pics that's not what i'm known for <laughs> but if anyone knows different platforms that you can sell feet photos please let us know down in the comment section okay my next hustle on my list is to sell nude pics now with these photos you want to make sure that they are not anywhere on the internet and they are specifically exclusive again you can sell these on your store if you have a mini vids as a store item and i'm pretty sure you can just tweet out to your fans like hey if you want an exclusive photo for this amount of price dm me or something you know how to go about it next um you can sell different clothing items and i just any clothing item like your regular clothes um items like your panties your socks your stockings your lingerie and people will buy them like it's a huge huge audience that will love to buy the items that have been on your body. And also for my adult film stars are people that create your own content. If you're wearing items in these videos that you're selling are for my adult film stars, if you have clothing items that you wore on set, sell them, you know, like you have evidence. <laughs> in video that those clothing items touch your body all right so definitely taking advantage profit and like i always say make your money honey next um dinner dates so by dinner dates i mean actually dinner dates which mean nothing is expected besides you accepting a meal between you and another person and a very popular website for dinner dates is called what's your price it is affiliated with seeking arrangement seeking.com if you're on both websites you'll see the basically the same guys but yeah what's your price is the website you want to use and basically with that website you don't want to use any photos that are already on the internet you want to take completely different photos um i tried getting on there um about a few months ago and i got rejected because the photos that i used were photos that were on my instagram 
so definitely take completely new photos also your email do not use the same business email um that's either in your instagram bio or anywhere where is the dell affiliated so make sure you have a completely new email address and yeah create a profile put something sassy in the bio and just wait i mean you can wait for guys to message you and offer you a price or you can tell them hey this is my price and either you know you can counter it or agree with it and like i said you will go for whatever meal was discussed whether if it's coffee dinner lunch whatever and you will set your payment and that's it i mean whatever else happens is whatever else happened but i have used what's your price before like way back in the day honey okay <laughs> i have used what's your price before and it was it was great like the guy he he gave me money um he let me choose the restaurant i wanted to meet him at and it was it was amazing i believe that's the only time i really used what's your price was just that one time but yeah definitely check it out i believe i could be wrong i believe the maximum you can accept is 200 dollars. but someone please correct me if i'm wrong that's that was the maximum when i was on there about three years ago so someone please check me if i'm wrong next on my list is youtube if you have a good personality and you have these crazy stories and you have some tips that you want to share definitely make a youtube channel there are a lot of adult performers that are creating channels and want to share their experience on this platform so yeah try it out last on my list is becoming a mentor now being a mentor is not for everyone, but if you are a patient person and you're passionate about teaching people and you're slowly retiring, but when you were in the game full force, you was at the top of the top, um, and you're willing to give your tips and tricks back to people that are willing to pay, become a mentor. Um, you don't only have to do one-on-one -on -one mentor training. You can do online courses. You create videos. You can create a book. I mean, there is so many different types of materials that you can create to give out your expertise. So, yeah, try it out. Okay, you guys, so that's the end of my list of side hustles. As I said before, some of these things I have done myself. I will put it in the description box. Um, others, I haven't given it a try yet, but if you have done these things, please let us know in the comment section. And also, if you have any side hustles, uh, drop it down in the comment section as well. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. Bye.